Whoa, who's this fella? I was just walking through the alleyway and there's this guy sitting here. Ugh, are you the boy from the forest? I finally met you. I have something to tell you. Mr. Game and Watch! The Gerudo King of Thieves betrayed our king. Zelda's nanny, Impa, sensed danger and escaped the castle with our princess. I tried to stop Donkey Kong. evil men from chasing them, but the princess was waiting for a boy from the forest. That's you. She wanted to give you some give something to the boy. If you received it from the princess, hurry to the temple of time. Ah, dead. Dead. That's some dark shit right there. I'm guessing the thing that she wanted to give me is the thing that I just got. The Ocarina of Time. Oh, I'm sorry. The Ocarina of Time. So if we come here, here's the Happy Mask Shop. Hi! Welcome to the Happy Mask Shop. We deal in masks that brings happiness to everyone. Would you like to be a happiness salesman? I'll lend you a mask, sell a mask, and bring the money back here. If you want to read the fine print, take a look at the sign. <clears throat> Excuse me. Right over there. You've, if After you've sold all the masks, you will become happy yourself. Have faith. So, what if I want to be a happy mask salesman? Why, why, why don't you just let me do that? Yeah, okay, I, I get that. I've read through the dialogue. But... Oh... He said that the first time, and I'm just stupid. Okay. Yeah, I get it. Okay, I know how this works. Oh my god, do we have to sit through this again? Jesus Christ. Come on! You let me do this to the owl! You let me skip the owl! Okay, so the first mask we're gonna buy is the Keaton mask. Like... The Michael Keaton mask and uh, the place you gotta take this is Kakariko Village which we got we got stuff to do there anyhow so um I'll see you guys there okay remember the guy who kept calling me mr. hero made fresh for you uh, well you give him the mask Wahaha! Do you think you're in disguise, Mr. Hero? Oh, is that the key something character mask? You, bitch, you never heard of Michael Keaton mask? That key something mask. I need it if you don't mind. Will you sell it to me? Hell yeah, I'll sell it to you, boy. Whoa. <laughs> I mean, you could just... You don't have to wear it, but okay. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, cool. So I made a five rupee profit. So we gotta go back to the happy mask salesman. But, and this is a big but, not before we do other shit. Because we got other shit to do. There's this lady. She's lost her cuckoo. Um, and uh, we need to get it back to her. So that's what we're gonna do. Oh, I f that's what I was missing. That's what I forgot. Was There was another heart piece at Lake Hylia that well not Lake Hylia at uh Zora's River that we could have gotten but that's that's not a big deal we don't we don't need it at this moment but right now we're gonna get ourselves an empty bottle from collecting these chickens uh I think I'm gonna speed this up because uh it's it's a bit of an annoying process so let's go ahead and do that
My cuckoos have run away. Please help me bring the last one. Oh. Uh, there's still one more. Okay. Uh, let's begin the search, I guess. Oh, I know where it is. I know where it is. It's, uh, right up here. Thank you for finding my cuckoos. I have allergies, so I get goosebumps when I touch them. Then why the fuck do you- why do you have chickens if you're allergic to them? Yay, it's a- it's a bottle! Yay! Okay. So... I think, uh... Actually, now that I think about it, um... Let's grab one of these. I know I know we just spent all this time fucking bringing her chickens back to her. But uh I I'm I'm sorry. We need to do this. We can get another fucking heart piece and I'm greedy as fuck, so I want it. Bruh. Look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the <laughs> no 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 <laughs> Well I didn't think about doing it that way. Wow, I suck. Okay. <laughs> that was very glitchy. Anyhow, here we are, fucking finally. That was a pain in the ass. Wow, one more piece and we level up. Okay, well, not level up, but we get another fucking container. So, anyhow, so while we're here, we're gonna come over here to the graveyard, um, and we're gonna get the sun song, and I believe there's yet another heart piece to get here. I know that we can do Dompe's fucking, like, dig gra the uh, grave digging game where you have him dig, like, a patch of land and you can fucking, you know, get a, get a, get him to dig a fucking heart piece up, but, like, no thank you. Man, fuck you, you little kid. I wonder if he'll still yell at me, even, uh, actually... We don't even get the sun song from that one, so I don't even know what I'm doing. By your powers combined, I am Captain Planet! Captain Planet, he's a hero. Gonna take pollution down to zero. He's a power magnified. So, playing the song causes lightning to come down and destroy that fucking tombstone, so now we come down here, and, uh, I'm, I'm starting to think that this is not actually, no, no, I remember now, you have to kill the bats, you have to kill the keys, because I remember my last playthrough, I had, I, I thought I had to light the torches, and so I, I, I lit them. And I was like, oh, it just gives you a fucking chest with, like, five rupees in it. What do I do? And, uh, and then I killed all the keys in here, and then it turns out that that was actually what I had to do. Alright. So now we meet the creepy, but... Not as creepy as everybody makes them out to be re-deads. Uh... 
Okay, now I can lock on now that he's that close. Come on, Link. Move. In fact, just don't even... Just don't even bother with them. Don't even bother with them. Just go on. Go to the next room and get yourself the fucking sun song. We'll be okay. Er, I have to check this. This poem is dedicated to the memory of the dearly departed members of the royal family. A rising sun will eventually set, a newborn's life will fade. From sun to moon, moon to sun. Give peaceful rest to the living dead. This is an interesting poem, huh? Something is inscribed on the tombstone. It's the secret melody of the, com uh, of the Composer Brothers. There we go. And now, the whole point of the sun song is it turns night to day, day to night. Uh, so if there's certain events that you need it to be nighttime to happen, then uh, you can use the sun song. It makes it super easy. I actually just recently, I know that this is going to make me sound really stupid, but I, I just recently learned that you can use the sun song to stun redeads. So... At least that's that's what I hear. That's what they tell me. Oh wow, it's true. Well, they mostly drop magic potions, so I'm much more interested in rupees to be honest with you. And uh yeah. So that's that's that. That's the sun song, fellas. So now um it'd be really cool to get our heart piece. At least uh as far as I know there is a heart piece. Please don't stop me, Navi. Okay, I won't get yelled at. See See the little boy is all like, "Don't don't mess with the graves or I'll tell Dampe." You know, but then Dompe's actually here himself, and and he's like, nah, nah, dude, I don't care. Dompe's super laid back. And there, we got a Hylian shield, and we didn't even need to pay for it, so that's the nice thing. It's nice on ice. And we come in here, and I'm pretty sure that's a fairy fountain. Um, fuck it, let's. Let's go ahead and catch ourselves another fairy. Why not? Although I was pretty sure that there was a heart piece in here. Or somewhere around here. I could be absolutely wrong. I'm probably I'm probably definitely wrong. Because I collected all the heart pieces in my last run through of this game. And, uh, and now that I think about it, I don't remember any being down here. There is one in a grave site. But it's after you are an adult so uh we'll come back but i really want that one heart piece that we're missing and i think that'll be the the last of the heart pieces i'll collect um and then we'll just finish up the happy mask side quest and we'll uh we'll head on over to uh so i read somewhere that uh that you can use the boomerang here to get the fucking heart piece from up there. But I'm not exactly sure how, or, uh... Yeah, I'm not exactly sure how you would do that. Oh, wow. It was that easy, huh? Okay, there, we've completed another heart. So that's, what, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine hearts. Nine hearts out of 20. So we're not doing half bad, considering that we're not even done being a kid yet. And we have, uh, fucking so much <laughs> anyhow um, just gonna go ahead and do that just get some extra shit and I, I, I don't know guys I guess I'll see you in Castletown oh wait wait hold up 
I almost forgot. I almost completely forgot. And I'm so glad that I didn't. Uh, we gotta collect the big wallet. Because I do have more than ten sculptulas, so... We head into this creepy-ass, unsuspecting house where there is a cursed family who has been turned into sculptulas. And his family will slowly become uncursed as you collect more gold sculptulas and give you rewards. Here's a reward for you. It's a fucking adult's wallet. Now we can carry 200 rupees. Which is pretty cool. <sighs> So, I think that's all we have so far. For every ten we collect, we uncurse somebody, so... Yeah, we still got six more to go until our next one. And even then, uh, the only valuable items really for me are... They give you a, they give you a heart piece at some point, and, uh, and they give you a giant's wallet at some point. And, uh... Other than that, they give you some sort of, like, shitty rumble pack thing, which is super helpful considering that I'm on the virtual console on the Wii, so absolutely useless Nintendo 64 exclusive item there. Um, and just, uh, just fun times, man, just fun times. But that's all beside the point. Uh, we're going to head into Castletown, and we're going to have ourselves a good time. Um, especially now that it's, it, we have the sun song, there's, there's something we can do at night. We'll get one more heart piece, guys. One more. And then that'll be it. Whoa, holy shit, I, I was gonna cut this part out, because I was just trying to collect some rupees, but I guess we found a gold sculpture while we were at it, so that's pretty cool. Okay, guys, now that we're back at the Happy Mask Shop, he's like, Oh, great, you sold it. Please pay back 10 rupees for the Keaton Mask. Payment received. So now he has the Skull Mask, who, uh... will obviously be giving this to, uh... to a Skull Kid. So, we'll want to head back to the Lost Woods. But now I have enough money to test my fucking skills in a game of fucking shoot the targets. Yeah. Yeah, come here. Do you want to play a game? It's 20 rupees per play! Okay, yep. There we go. If you hit eight of them, he lets you try again for free. Okay, I was getting really worried there for a second. Oh, Jesus Christ. Almost got it. Almost got it. Damn it, son of a bitch. Well, at least I get to try again for free. We almost got it first try. That would have been nice. I really just wish there were some, like, crosshairs or something, but I guess this would be too easy if there were. I always forget that there, there's gonna be two blue ones. God damn it! Fucking A. The best we can do now is get another free game, boys. Okay. This time. Third try. Let's do it. Third attempt is gonna be the success arena. Let's, let's get it on. Yeah! Two! Yeah! Three! Yeah! Four! Okay, two blue ones. Got him. Yeah, we got those. Come on. Are you fucking kidding me? God damn it, son of a fucking bitch. Oh my god, I hate this fucking minigame. This minigame can fucking suck my dick. That would be kind of nice, actually. Um, okay. It's okay. Don't, don't lose your patience, Josh. Do not lose your patience yeah see we made up for it and then we lost it <sighs> at least we're doing well enough to get our free games so I don't have to spend another 20 rupees so that's nice that's nice if this keeps going on though for long enough then I'm definitely cutting some of it out or speeding it up or something 
But, uh, for now, I think we're on, like, what, attempt five? Oh. Oh, no. We got it this time! Wonderful! Bravo! Perfecto! Here's a fantastic present. Thanks, boy! And now I can hold 50 of them. That's great. So now, now we're gonna go play the harder game of the two, which is the Bomb Chew Bowling Alley. Fuck this game, dude. The, the last one's bad, but this one's badder. Sleeping on the job? Dude, how much do you even get paid? Welcome to our cutting edge amusement center. The Bomb Chew Bowling Alley. Do you want to know what you can win? Well, it's a secret. I can't tell you until you've paid to play. It's 30 rupees per game. Okay. That's all I can afford, so I better win this time. Aim for the hole in the center and let the bomb chew go. You get 10 tries. Ready? Let's bowl. I almost forgot. Here is what you can win. What? That's just money. Okay, I want a fucking big bomb bag, okay? And don't lie to me. I know I can win it. Oh, shit. Okay, good, good. Yep. That's how you do it. Okay, then one more. And this one's the hard one because it has a big fucking chicken in the way. God damn it. Okay. Wow. We hit the little chicken. We still have six tries, so let's not get get discouraged now okay we're gonna we're just gonna keep fucking this up huh oh oh yeah winner that's great that's a good thing right there yeah I'll play again what I know I don't want to play anymore fucking a so like what do you what do you have to do to win the fucking biggest bomb bag? I don't Do you have to come back when you're an adult? Do you have to find the, the new bomb chew bowling alley as, as an adult? I'm starting to think that that's the case. Cause I don't care about fucking winning some bomb chews, dude. I really I couldn't give a shit less. Like bomb chews are cool and all, but like fuck them. You know, they're not they're not super important. There's like one time you use them in one dungeon, and that's that's like that's pretty much it, dude. Fuck, I'm just gonna spam them. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do it. I don't, I don't want anything to do with. Wow, I accidentally. Whew. Okay, let's just fucking let's get out of here. I'm I'm not too concerned. No shit. Okay, good. I'm happy. I don't have enough rupees. Fuck you. At least give me another 50 rupees. Like, that would be nice. Anyhow, what we want to do now is, uh... Well, we have the Skull Mask, which is pretty cool. And, uh... And we're gonna go ahead and do that trading sequence in just a second. But for right now... No, you know what? No. No. Okay. Well, there's this lady at nighttime in Castletown. Okay, I'll spill the beans on it now. There's this lady at nighttime in Castletown who loses her dog, and she's like, I need my pupper back. You find my lost pupper. And, uh, and it's really easy, it's really simple, but it has to be nighttime. And now that I think about it, like, I'm gonna get done with the happy mask thing before I do any of that shit. So, uh,. I will see you guys in the Lost Woods.